Yo, what is good YouTube? This is Vortex. I'm back with a new uh, Resident Evil game here. This is Resident Evil Zero. Um, this is this is Resident Evil Zero. Walk through part one. Um, like I said, remember guys, I told you I wanted to bring you all more of the other Resident Evil games content as much as, as much as possible. So this is supposed supposed to be the prequel to the uh, to Resident Evil and Resident Evil Remastered from where the where everything happened in the mansion um, with Jill, Barry, Wesker, and everybody. But I'm gonna actually do this in on hard mode. Um, I definitely want to try to do this um, Zero. difficulty. Gonna do wide, alternate, and subtitles on. But like I said, guys, I want to do my best to try to bring you all more content. But with that, I'll let this cussing go. And town in America, I'll be back. Raccoon City. A solitary island far off in the sea, Rockfort Island. An island that would become the second Raccoon City, Sheena Island. There are still many unanswered questions about these seemingly unrelated yet intensely traumatic events. Though it is believed that the International Enterprise Umbrella was somehow involved, little is known as to the origin of this faceless corporation. When was it established? By whom? And how was the T-Virus created? To uncover the truth, we must delve deeper into the events which transpired in the beginning, before the mansion incident. Hmm. Do you think so too? Yeah. as a simple investigation of some bizarre murders in the suburbs of Raccoon City. Nothing in our training could ever have prepared us for the nightmare that ensued. We never stood a chance. What's going on? Engine failure! Emergency landing! Check the current position and investigate the surrounding area. Captain, look! <gasps> Captain! Hmm? What happened? Order for transportation. Prisoner Billy Cohen, ex lieutenant, 26 years old. Court martialed and sentenced to death July 22nd. Prisoner is to be transferred to the Regathon base for execution. Those poor soldiers. They were good men just doing their jobs, and that scum murdered them and escaped. 
All right, everyone. Let's separate and survey the area. Our friend is brutal and ruthless. Keep your guard up. All right, guys, we are back. Just wanna check out these files. This is pretty much talking about how to operate the player, everything like that, how to move, maneuver. And this is pretty much talking about, this court order is talking about Billy Cohn, person we are, well, Rebecca is looking for at the moment while you know investigating this place so let's get a move another cutscene coming this is officer chambers from stars bravo team please identify yourself someone there. Pretty much you would just turn around, well you would just aim at the zombies. Rebecca automatically does it the first time. You can kind of run away. And should be good. Another cutscene. What just happened? I, I thought they were dead. So, yeah, that takes care of that. Um, used ammo. And we'll combine that, what should I say? And then move on. Wait, did I go? No, we're good. Right, I just want to double check. All right. I gotta come through here. Room 202. First door on your right, which is technically your left. You can come in here. Come right here to get this document. Get it. Passenger's diary, July 14th. Orders came from the boss today. This is just info. Talking about everything that transpired throughout the the time that the train got hit. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, whenever you know, whenever the the attack started happening, and then pretty much throughout, I guess what four days or something, a week, people, you know, they were giving instructions and stuff on what to do. Actually, yeah, now, now I'm thinking about it, <laughs> wrong info, this is talking about them, talking about, you know, this is going on at Raccoon City, so that's my bad, 
wrong info. Now we gotta get ready to get into a little fight here. Let's, let's check this body. It's holding something. Let me grab the key. Another cutscene. soldiers outside. Oh, I see. You're with stars. Well, no offense, honey, but your kind doesn't seem to want me around, so I'm afraid our little chat time is over. Wait! You're under arrest! No thanks, Dollface. I've already worn handcuffs. I could shoot, you know. This is the tricky part. Gotta shoot. Keep shooting. Ah, see. Ah, get off me. I tried to, I tried to, you know, again, like I said, it's the tricky part because you can't see around those uh, corridors when you're um, being attacked by those dogs. I check the body. A few hours, he's holding something. And more hang hand, uh, ammo. Hang on, ammo. But yeah, that's, that's a tricky, tricky part of uh, your first real encounter, well, you're technically your second real encounter of the zombified things, and you got zombie in here, well, two of them, actually. Go down, go down, stand. All right, let's come up to it. Okay. Let's do that. And then we are heading to the next cart. But yeah, like I said guys, that 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 part where the dogs are, that that's a tricky place now the cuts. This is Rebecca. Over. To the next car. Key, unlock it. Let's go. But yeah, that, like I said, guys, that where the area where the dogs are, that's, you know, because you're 
standing in that section. It's bad. Another cuts. More cuts. It's just bad. It's just a bad area to be. Again, trying to shoot at something you can't see. It's going to be dangerous from here on in. Why don't we cooperate? Cooperate with you? Listen, little girl, if you haven't noticed, there's some pretty freaked out things on this train. And I, for one, want to get out of here. I don't think we stand a chance doing it alone. You expect me to trust you, a wanted felon? I don't need your help. I can handle this on my own. And don't call me little girl. All right, Miss Do-It-Yourself. What should I call you? The name is Rebecca Chambers, but that's Officer Chambers to you. Well then, Rebecca. Why don't you go and try while I wait here? All right. Once that conversation is done, you come over, and grab the document here. I think this is the this is the document I was talking about when they were giving instructions. Um, about what to do and where to go, type of thing. This is what that was. That other document was talking about the actual stuff that was going on within Raccoon City. That's all. And and also this is giving instructions on where there's a ladder to get to another part of the train that we need to go. But here we go. Going up. Another cutscene. Excuse me, sir. Sir. <gasps> this part I found funny. Watch. Comes up. Go to the stairs, run to the stairs. How did Rebecca get back to the middle of the room? If you if you physically took her to the stairs, you know, physically made her go to the stairs. Look at look at your boy. Come on, Billy, you're not you're not that dude. That's all I'm trying to say. engine car listen we've got to cooperate with each other from now on you got that well I don't clue in girl or maybe you like being worm bait all right but you just remember I will shoot you if you try anything funny fine now take these with you if you find anything give me a call all right Alright, and this is talking to you about <clears throat> how to swap between characters, you know, between your partners and stuff, and, you know, different other things, but we'll go through all of that more later. Alright, so, what I want to do on exchange weapons, which is great, and that's about it. Cause pushing the triangle button will s oh whoa 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 before I do that <laughs> before 
before I do that. That's what I got. Um, yes. Is that a team? Because he'll team meaning he'll come with me. I want to go solo, so I'm able to take the ladder without him. He'll stay right here. In this cart, and I'll travel. Which I kind of find insane. I'm like, you know, Rebecca goes up and she's traveling on this fast speeding train. Knowing me, if I would have tried to go across this fast speeding train, I would have slipped and fell and there would be no more vortex. <laughs> That's all I can say. <laughs> that is all I can say. So pretty much you would come all the way over here to this sparking uh, spot. Hit the action button. Yes, you want to. Yes, you want to connect the cables. Bust the cables. Now the cuts. Right, now she's up, and let me check something. Okay. Before I, uh, well, this is over here. Let me grab the key first. I'm gonna grab this. I am going to grab this herb real fast and use it because again Rebecca did get bit by those dogs again like always this is not a um, no damage walkthrough I want to use this service uh, machine here Uh, so if you want to put an item in it, you say yes, and you want to put the keys that you just got into there, let it close, and send it down. Yes. Because we're going to give those to Billy, which we're going to swap over to Billy now. All right. We're heading down. Come through here. Go around. And come to the machine. And grab the keys. Yes. And we are heading up. And through the door. The room that, um... Rebecca is in she it's she, she is stuck there All right. drop that zombie All right, another one in here and that should be it Um, yeah, well, come on, let's, actually, you know what, let me, um, unequip the weapon, and then <clears throat> come through the door, because there's a zombie in here that gets up. And because you're quick enough, you can dodge it. Yeah, there it goes. <coughs> Reminds me of Chris Redfield in my walkthrough of his uh <coughs> excuse me, of his <coughs> of his um walkthrough. Alright. Uh you're going straight around to the store. Unlock it, yes. Throw it away. Go through the door. Okay, I'm gonna grab the not yet. Well, it's cool, it's fine. Either way, I don't think it mattered. But you wanna grab the map. And here. 
then turn around, grab this document laying on the floor. This is talking about the key cards. Stuff of that nature. Pretty much saying that this is the stuff that we will need for later, probably more than likely. Uh, and I'm gonna be, I'm gonna live a little dangerous. I'm gonna, I'm gonna toss the. I'm gonna toss the gun. Cause there's a boss fight getting ready to come up, and I wanna. And I, I have been practicing off screen guys pretty much why I'm so knowledgeable in this area so far. Cutscene. It's definitely not a good thing. That's pretty much letting me know that there's a boss just above us. But yeah, I toss the gun because I wanna you know, try this on this upload. You wanna come here, you wanna grab this ice pick, we're gonna need it for later. Alright, we wanna come through this door. There's a shotgun in here, you wanna grab that. And there shotgun shells pick up the shotgun shells over the the handgun and then come through the door okay this is gonna be the test I'm gonna grab my knife come through the door and then the next set of the next door that I go through will be the fight of my life. Actually, this this room actually one last time. Cutscene, baby. This fight. Move, 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 move. All right, just pretty much just attack the attack the scorpion with the knife. It shouldn't. I mean, if it if it decides to attack with its sting rating, you just run back. It should be fine. It just takes it just takes patience. This is probably about a minute, close to a minute and a half fight. I think I think it's about to be a wrap. Watch! 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 should be fine. As long as you do, do it this way, you should be alright. Yep, we're good. We, we beat it. I did it. <laughs> Officially did it. For the first time, I defeated this thing without, <laughs> without this cat getting hit. Which I'm proud of. You you get two trophies for doing it. Um, at the moment, I can't remember exactly what they are. I, I did. You get two trophies for defeating the the scorpion without the you know with just the knife, and you can get rid of the knife too if you want. I'm going to. Um, and then I, I guess you get a trophy for something else. You want to pick this up? Pick it up. 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 Will you pick that thing up? Thank you. <laughs> you all heard me. I'm, I'm mashing the X button like crazy. Pick that up. Pick it 
that thing up. All right, climb down these this this ladder here. Okay, now we're gonna come in here because there's a suitcase we gotta pick up. Could have grabbed it, maybe, possibly, maybe, possibly. Before we went to fight the um, squirrel, let me make sure I got it. Okay, cool, got it. All right, then we are heading out. Okay. You want to go to this room, room 201. You want to come in here. You want to leave the, the suitcase. And then grab the ink because we are saving the game and that folks will do it for this first this part one walk through put that right there of uh resident evil zero the beginning technically so with that guys i am out Thank you for your viewership as always. Be sure to hit that like button. Leave comments. Let me know what you all thought. Um, subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification buttons. And I will chat with you all with more Resident Evil Zero Part 2 walkthrough to come. Peace, guys.